So as long as I'm on this admitting things on camera situation where I was com uh, admitting about how I dress and how I care what people think, I kind of admit it to care what people think, but I'm really about to admit it here. I care what people think so much to where when I'm rolling with someone, because sometimes I change the music to appear more cool. Sometimes I like how people look at me and thank me so much that I'll turn to a song and skip to a point where it's me talking my mess. I'll skip to a song where people talk about like being jealous and they're not be rapping that to like exude confidence or this, that, and the third. I have to like be able to admit to myself when I've done wrong or when I have issues and then I have to pray on them. I, yeah, of course I want my materialistic things, but I want... To. California really showed me that I would rather be stronger in myself than have anything on this planet. At least for me. I'm not saying, you know, like, like I'm just all this all-powerful person. Obviously not. And I'm just like so gifted that the evil can't stand me. Clearly, it's some issues within myself. You know what I'm saying? I don't want me praying for this, that, and the third, but feel like I'm not getting it because I can't admit my the, the problems within myself are getting in the way of what I'm asking for. This is what I pray for. I have got to make my spirit so strong that my physical body cannot come close to doing what it wants to do. Like you know, like the fleshly wants and stuff like that. I ask God to like to take away that power that my spirit have that strength over my flesh that my flesh can't even come close. Me always wanting to show my butt off. Yeah, it's gains or whatever, but it's like, it's like I'm clearly trying to make these outfits good to show off my butt, but every time I go out, I don't feel confident. I feel like people are laughing at me. So maybe I need to really take this as a sign. Even despite what I just said in the two episodes ago, or maybe last episode, I went out again just yesterday and I had the problem again. I was just wearing this nice little, it was a crop top shirt, not too crop, but it stopped to like right about right here, you know, you can see a little bit of skin like right here. And I was wearing some nice blue pants, or the, it was like a matching set. But I'm like, other gay people can do this, that, and the third, and like, it's like, what is it about me? You know, like, am, is it not, am I not supposed to be doing what all these other people are doing? Like, can I, should I not wear crop tops? Like, like, should I not be like, a, you know, like, I'm not saying that, <sighs> this is confusing, like, I'm not trying to be all about my butt, but if the outfit looks good, then like, why can other people rock what I wear and not get hate for it, but when I do it, it's like, like, clearly it's not for me, right? That's what I want to, like, I'm seeing that, but like, why am I fighting myself so hard on that? Why can't I just wear a nice lawn trench coat with this outfit I want to wear? Why do I have to find the crop top version of it because my butt looks good in it? How do I fight that? That's what I prayed for. You know, if that makes sense. I try to convince myself, oh my gosh, it's gains, you know, your, your butt looks good in these pants, like, and the outfit can still eat. But then again, that outfit was kind of just like very basic. It wasn't giving anything. Like it wasn't rich with glasses and hats and the, the, the accessories. I got one more time to see something. I know, I know what you're thinking. Oh my gosh, you're just Probably trying to- after five minutes. I know what you're thinking. You're probably thinking, oh my gosh, you just want to show off your butt so bad. And do, I can admit that. I'm thick. It's got gains, but I need to see one more thing because the outfits that I wear never look or don't look expensive. They just look very average. I don't dress them up. I watch sometimes I try to, and that's it's a lot. But let me see something. Okay, another thing I would like to add. Another thing I would like to add is like. I go out being a bad B, you know, like, even though my outfits are really, I'm not even going to sit here and act like they're not cute. I feel like some of them, you know, could be better, but it's like I could get away with this stuff on the East Coast and I can't over here, which clearly has to do deal with like, you know, different vibes and atmosphere and scenery in the place because, you know, people out here judgmental. So everybody feels like they have to drop, you know, dress up and down and this, that, and the third, or dress up and wear all these expensive things. When in reality, I'm not used to this. What I wear here is like so cute over somewhere else. Hmm. I have to think of it like that. Okay. So I just thought of something. You know, it has to, I have to think about like how I was on the East Coast. Like over in the East Coast in Georgia, every day people will be complimenting me left and right. Ooh, look at you with crop tops and all. Outfits that I see were super ugly 
that I would not be caught dead with over dead with over here, I could wear over there. It feels like I very much have to get with the program over here, or people are gonna continue to judge me. But then I want to test getting with the program and still see how people judge me because what I was saying when I was going into the refrigerator, it's like I cannot deal with the repercussions of being a baddie B. I can't. This is gonna sound so conceited, but it is what it is. And you know, I, I, as I always say, when they speak, they meant that I say what I see, and I, I, I say what I see, and I see what I say. Just because you don't want to see it doesn't mean I'm not gonna say it. So yesterday when I went out with my little nice blue crop top, uh, blue shirt with the matching blue pants, what was looking good? I was walking toward H and M to do my little refunds. I was talking about. I don't even know if I incorporated into the vlog, but I was walking to do those returns. I'm walking by and I hear men saying, "God." Well, one, I'm not, and then it was he was saying with the guy inside, and they go, "Look," but they were saying, "Now eyeballing me," and then people to the left were looking at people Adically, behind. After one Can you hush? For the edit something for C3. It's like, okay, so I'm getting the attention that I want, but then when I start getting hating energy and negative energy, I don't know how to deal with that. You know what I mean? It's like I got what I want, but then I don't know how to deal with like hating girls. You know. Or guys who be looking at me with their girlfriend but talk mess about me to their girlfriend so their girlfriend don't figure out that that man actually liked what he saw. Because that's what I was being for a lot of my life. I, as you guys heard in the last episode, exactly that, you know. Um, I was talking about, you know, like how, the, how these boys are... <sighs> I'm just tired of not being able to do me without being in my head about it all. I want to not care what people think. If I want to wear a holy shirt and present myself like a homeless man in the middle of rodeo i don't want to be affected by nobody i want to be that strong within myself and that's the goal i i'm starting to realize that it's not so much what i wear but it's me changing what i wear because i don't know how to not care what people think when it comes to me. like it's like i i am a bad b but i don't know Talking to the cameras is just therapy. I'm not even gonna put all of this in. I'm probably gonna have to cut a lot of this out. Or I'll just edit it separately and upload it as a whole separate video. Like a little, you know, yeah, I'll do that. So I know I'm probably contradicting myself, but that happens a lot when it's me versus me. I know that sounds crazy, but you know, we've had that talk in, you know, episode seven. It's like I'm trying to get caught up with my right self, the right day, you know what I mean? As in the right day of like, me, you know, like the me that needs to like, the prime me. We're gonna call me the right day, the prime me, like me and my prime with my energy together, m knowing myself, my definite in myself, you know, my definiteness in myself. I want to know how to control my power and I want to know, that's what I want to know. I want to know if I'm looking at this at the wrong angle, do I need to watch how I dress and, you know, not... I'm not centered around my butt, but then again, yes, I am. No, I have to admit, yes, I am. But now I look at it as, are my outfits ugly? That when, like, are my outfits that show my butt ugly? Because they don't look rich and this, that, and the third. But if I were to, like, show off my butt wearing the... the, the nicest outfit how would the reactions be like it's like it's basically me saying like okay here's my butt looking great in this little basic matching blue set of clothes with a nice little necklace a nice little chain and this that and the third okay and then here's my butt looking good in this nice crop jacket and these nice matching green pants that match this nice green cop crop jacket with the nice bucket hat and the glasses and the accessories on point and the bag and shoes on point like that i need to like see how the energy is versus my butt in those clothes and my butt in these clothes i have to say it i have to say it it's like why does everything have to be about your butt i'm trying to i literally just prayed for that to go away so hopefully that'll go away soon but as of this moment i need to see something for this version of me because maybe when i figure something out with me wearing those nice clothes and my butt looking good something will come out of it for you know okay clearly i need to just i feel like you know time, everything is in time so the more i test things and the more i figure things out the more things will come to me so maybe it'll be revealed like okay 
so yeah it's not it's weird to be you know centering your clothes around your butt and how good it looks but then again a lot of people wear clothes to show off their figure it's natural for people to have their uh to wear um certain pants because their butt looks good it's like in my head i feel like it's such a a negative thing and maybe that's why i'm fighting myself on is because i i feel like maybe it's not for me it should not be i need therapy like i i really want a therapist i just cannot afford it the freest thing i could do right now is just at just say everything on camera watch it back and see how i feel when my head is clear and see what i can get from it i don't want to have to step out of the house i want to be able to put on something very simple and nice to go run my little errands and not care what people think i don't want to have to dress up super luxurious like i'm going out all the time just to go run some errands to avoid people not looking at me a certain type of way i i touched on this earlier in this video i want I want to continue to be bad because I'm fine. I'm bad. Like I'm built right. I look good. Skin I'm getting good. What skin is good? I just gotta uh, keep it up. There's just like so much going around my head to where like I try to even it out by throwing energy into possibilities of why things are happening to me when it's really me. If I want to show my butt off, it's fine. But I need to be confident in myself enough to not let people affect me. I need to be okay with like all of the stuff that comes with. You know, wearing what I wear and me being me as a black gay man here around a bunch of pathetic straight men who always got something to say about gay folks. And then a bunch of hating people. Now, I know how this sounds. I know how this sounds. But if y'all were to shadow me, y'all would be like, what the fuck is wrong with these people? I really just be minding my business doing me. I don't know how to deal with being that bad girl that girls are gonna look at and some girls are gonna look at and hate on and some guys are gonna laugh at because they can't mind their business. I just wanna be sure and confident in myself regardless of what I'm doing, regardless of what I'm wearing. I don't wanna be swayed by people anymore. I'm tired of being swayed by people. I don't wanna feel their energy. I don't want nothing to do with these people out here. I want to be left alone. If I get a real friend, that's cool. If I get a boyfriend, which I highly doubt I'm gonna find a boyfriend out here i highly doubt my soulmate is out here. i highly doubt my soulmate is out here if he is that's cool maybe he'll come when i come to myself i need people in the future to tell me i don't know how far i am from it now if i'm far from that and this no longer applies for like just t even just still just tell me is it weird that i plan outfits that show off my figure but then also think about it as in the sense of clearly your outfit, like tell me like, as in like clearly your outfits aren't good. Although your butt looks good, this outfit isn't cute. Y'all don't even know the outfits to judge it though. 